Last night, I heard the Lord say, um, she's trying to destroy you. And I wasn't sure if uh, he was talking about me specifically, or if he was talking about someone else. So I'm just going to put the message out. But I'm going to I'm going to say this as I was driving, you know, here, um, it kept repeating in my head, right? She's trying to destroy, she's trying to destroy. So I'm like, okay, this may be a message for more than one person. But obviously, as being anointed ones, you know, we're going to deal with this on a daily basis, okay? It's going to always be a new, a new devil when you get to a new level. I noticed every time like i launch something or i push my push something like my skincare or advertise something there's always people coming at me so i'm pretty sure you guys are gonna notice the same thing like as soon as you graduate one level and you're on to the next level you're gonna notice a bunch of these demons just trying because coming out of nowhere and stuff but anyways what he was showing me last night is that for some of you guys there's people that like are snooping okay like you live in their rent in their head rent free let's just say that like you have you have um you have property in their mind rent free like you literally live in their head rent free okay because they think about you when they wake up in the morning when they go to bed at night and the sad part about it what god was telling me is that he was saying that a lot of these people it's so sad it's so sad. It's like a lot of these people, they think about you before they even thank God for even waking them up in the morning. Before they thank God for, for the day that they've had. The first, that's, It's like they, 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 put, they, they try to figure out how to sabotage you. Remember in Proverbs, it says an evil person will not sleep until they destroy or until they plot, right? And these individuals, when it comes to the chosen ones, these individuals will stay up late at night thinking about new ways to sabotage you, thinking about new ways to try to tear you down, new ways to try to make you look bad. And what God was saying last night is is these people, they it's like not just one, it's a bunch of them. They'll sit down, they'll gossip about you. It's it's like they'll gossip about you all day <laughs> it's like you living in these people's head rent free and it's like listen go out there and do something in the world like go and change lives go and save souls you know what i'm saying go do something in the world go start a business you get what i'm saying a lot of these people it's like they're so consumed with watching y'all watching us chosen ones it's like they're so consumed with it to the point where it's like their own life is kind of withering away because all their energy and time is being put into you. It's being put into us. I'm saying us because we're all going through it, okay? And everyone, like y'all could be going through with family, with friends. Like there's always that one person that's just watching you or a bunch of people that are just watching and they don't like you. They hate your guts and they're just trying to figure out new ways to destroy you. And they go all, it's like, um, <laughs> you know, the cartoon I was telling you about with the, was it Roadrunner? It was Roadrunner, Road One, Roadrunner and Sylvester and Tweety, how he just sits there and plots new, new schemes. I think I talked about this before, like a month ago or two months ago. I'm gonna put that video in the, in the comment section below. Okay. That link so you guys can watch it. But it's like, it's just sad that people would rather use their time to do this. And it's like, you know, it's just sad because the way God was showing it to me last night is he was saying like, you know, they don't even, these people don't even pray before they go to bed or pray when they wake up. They're just so focused on how they're going to destroy you. And it's so sad because what they don't understand is the more they come after the chosen ones, the more they come after the anointed, the more blessed the anointed are going to be. The more miserable they're making their own lives. Like that's what people don't understand. That's why I always tell you guys, don't repay folly with folly because you don't want yourself to be miserable by trying to make someone else that's making you miserable, miserable. Do you get what I'm saying? because that's what they want they want you to block your own blessings right so you just have to send them love but yeah you live in rent free in their head you know a lot of us are living rent free in their head and um we got to pray for them pray that they find a hobby they find some extra cur curriculum activities to get into um you know write a book like something to help them because it's become an obsession okay it reminds me of when Saul Saul um, Saul was obsessing over David and it's, it's not cute it's very very it's not cute at all it's very um it's very scary actually um <clears throat> and it like I said I, it's happened to me so many times it's happened to me with family it's happened to me with colleagues at work it's happened to me on YouTube it's hot so I, I'm used to it but I'm pretty sure some of you guys is kind of starting to get to you and that's why God says don't even don't even repay it you know just just pray for them because to be honest it's 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 very sad for someone to be sitting down plotting on how they're going to destroy you that's very sad and people that do this stuff like 
honestly guys i'm not even saying this to be funny but like they need prayer like they need help you know it's not they need help you get what i'm saying and they need help and you have to understand something a reason why some people do this is because there's something in you that's triggering them there's something in you that they wish they had or they wish they could do or be and you know it's it, every time they watch you or time they spy on you whatever if it's instagram or whatever i had to block some accounts off instagram this morning too i had to do that because yeah but um regardless it's like you know they 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 looking for someone to punch it's like they're looking for a punching bag they're looking for someone to take their anger out on and that's what it is so you know we just have to pray for individuals like this okay and um yeah no like like honestly we have to pray for individuals like this because it's 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 pretty sad okay but like i said in the other video just don't don't repay whatever they're doing to you don't give them that same payment do the opposite like love them and pray for them and just hope that they can heal okay i love you guys